Dear UP community, I hope you are keeping well under the circumstances. It has been 43 days since we went into lockdown to flatten the cave and avoid an exponential rate of infections of the coronavirus COVID-19. In those 43 days, the lockdown was extended once and then replaced by level 4 regulations. Level 4 feels much the same, although there's been some easing. Most of us still have to stay home if you are not in the categories of sectors allowed to open. Social distancing, compulsory wearing of masks, washing our hands and good hygiene still apply. We can now exercise outside in the mornings, which is good for our health. Please continue to exercise as much as you can, including at home if you can. Today marks one week since we resumed teaching and learning online. While we've experienced some challenges, the transition has for the large part been better than expected. UP students throughout South Africa and from 20 countries across the world have successfully managed to access academic content through the specially developed UP Connect portal. Our online learning management system has made it possible for lecture sessions to be recorded and be made available to students to access online afterwards. We are working around the clock to resolve the few remaining glitches and snags. We've also managed to deliver a significant number of laptops and internet-enabled devices to students who, due to financial constraints, are not able to acquire it for themselves. For those of you who have not yet received your laptop, I ask that you be patient. Given the current circumstances, the delivery is taking a little longer than usual, but I can assure you that we are doing everything we can to get it to you as soon as possible. Those students who have not yet responded to our offer should do so as soon as possible so that they can access the online study materials available to them. We are also aware that some students are not able to connect online due to a lack of electricity or an internet connection. We are working on alternative plans to provide you with the study materials and I ask that you please contact your lecturer or head of department to make the necessary arrangements. These are unusual times, but the success of our students remains our top priority. Together, we will see this through. Until we meet again on campus, I urge you all to continue to take precautions and stay safe.